hello friends so today we will discuss about the heap sort i have already created a video for heap sort but uh, there there was some uh, marker issue so things were not very clear so i am recreating this uh, heap sort algorithm video so this is the pseudo code for heap sort so in this pseudo code to uh, do a heap sort first we need to build a max heap okay either you can build a max heap or min heap that depends on your requirement either you want to uh, do sorting in increasing order or decreasing order so for doing a sorting in increasing order we need to create a max heap then we start from the very last element and we will exchange the elements first element and last element we will exchange that then we reduce the size every time when we extract one sorted element we reduce the heap size by one again we will create a max heap so this is the max heapify for that particular element is to build the max heap because every time we are swapping the last and the first element so we will start max heapify from very first element so let me explain this algorithm with the help of an example now this is our uh, max heap so here you can see that every root element is greater than its child element. So 6 is greater than 14 and 10. 14 is greater than 8 and 7. And 8 is greater than 2 and 4. Similarly, 10 is greater than 9 and 3. So this is our max heap. And we want to uh, do a heap sort over it. Okay. So if you remember uh, the heap sort algorithm. So we start from very last element okay so so loop was from for i is equal to n to 2 yeah either 2 or 1 then we swap these two element swap a1 and a i so let me swap these elements so when i do swap then 1 will be here and 16 will be here okay now when it happens then you need to reduce this heap size then heap size reduced by 1 so it means earlier that this this complete tree was the heap now this is the heap we extracted this already sorted element so 16 is an already sorted element so we extract it from here we are not going to store the 16 anywhere else we are just uh, Ex, uh, adjusting the element within the array so no extra space is required by the heap sort okay now when i did this i reduced the heap size by one so if you remember the index of heap size started like this 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and 9 so after extracting the ninth element my next index will be 8 so this element will be used so now so let me erase these indexes this was for explaining okay now i have reached as the fourth element so before doing the exchange let me create the build heap again from the remaining elements so one is less than 14 and 10 so i will exchange the one with the bigger one biggest of these three so biggest is the 14 so this will be the 14 and this will be the 4 this will be the 1 now again here 8 and 7 and 1 so 1 is less than either both the 7 and 8 so we will exchange the 1 with the 8 so this process is called the heapify this process is called the heapify process so if you remember at the last statement was heapify a from 1 so every time we start we can either say 0 every time we start from the top of the element let me create it 0 every time we do the heapify from the top element because we just put the smallest element at the top of the element so we start uh, building the heap from the top of the element again 4 and 2 both are bigger than 1 so this will be the 4 and this will be the 1 okay now 
द न्यूली क्रिएटेड स्ट्रक्चर इज अगेन अ हीप सो अगेन वी स्टार्ट द प्रोसीजर सो दिस वॉट एवर वी आर आई वॉज डूइंग दिस दिस स्टेटमेंट आई वॉज री क्रिएटिंग द हीप ना अगेन लूप अगेन स्टार्ट वी स्वेप फोर्टीन एंड वन सो दिस विल बी द फोर्टीन एंड दिस विल बी द वन ओके ना आई डिड स्वेप Extract the element. Reduce the heap size by one. So it means this fourteen got extracted from the heap. So let me write down. So I have extracted fourteen and sixteen. Okay. Now again, what we need to do? Again, we create the heap. So for creating the heap, we start heapify the ten and eight and one. So ten is biggest one. So this will be the ten. This will be the one. Nine is bigger than so this will be the one. Okay, again this is a heap. Now I have reached here. So I have ten and two. So this will be the two. This will be the ten. Okay. <clears throat> Now extract this. So I extract the ten from this. I reduce the heap size by one. Now I have reached here. Whatever I am doing within the same area. Now I am. I have reached here. Okay. So before that, I need to max epify this. So when I do the max epify, nine and two and eight. Biggest one is nine. So I will replace this element with the bigger one. Biggest. So biggest is nine. This is the two in in both the three element in three element. Three is the biggest one. So this will be the three. This will be the two. So again, this is a heap. Now, I I have reached here. Okay. So exchange the I have reached here. So exchange this one element and this one element. Last heap element and the start of the heap element. So this will be the two. This will be the nine. Okay, extract the nine. Now this nine will be the part. This nine will be the part of the heap, and we are not going to take this nine anywhere else. This will be at this position. Okay, so nine. Now we have extracted this again. Do a max heapify from this index. So when I do a max heapify, so I will swap eight and three. So I will swap the two with the eight because eight is the biggest. Because we know in max epify root element will always be greater than its children. So root is greater than its children. Now again I will replace two with seven. Okay. Now this is the max heap, and I have reached here. Now swap eight and one. Okay. And extract the eight. So eight will come here. Now again, do max epify from this. When I do the max epify, seven will reach here, and one will come here. Now four will be here, and one will be here. Okay. Now I have reached here. Loop. Again, swap seven and two. So two will be here, and seven will be here. Extract the seven. I have extracted the seven. Reduce the heap size by one. I have reached here. Okay. Again, do the max epify. When I do the max epify, then four two three four. This will be the four. This will be the two. Okay. Now swap this and this. When I do swap, so one will be the here. Four will be the here. Extract the four. Extract the four. Okay, now again do the max epify. Then three will be here. One will be here. Okay. Now, yeah. Now I have reached the maximum point. Okay. Now this is three. This is one, and this is a swap three and one. When I swap. This will be three. Extract the three. Okay. Now this is not a maxi. Swap. So this will be twelve, two, and one. 
and now we have reached here swap 2 and 1 we swap 1 and 2 because of max cp phi okay swap these two element so this will be the 1 this will be the 2 extract 2 and reduce the heap size by 1 and finally 1 will remain so your order will be 1 2 3 4 7 8 9 10 14 and 16 so this is the procedure of heap sort and the complexity of heap sort is order of n and log n so this n comes from this we are iterating all the n elements we are visiting all the n elements and for each element we are calling the procedure of max cp phi and the complexity of max cp phi is log n so the overall complexity of order of n log n okay thanks for watching please subscribe my channel